Friar Alessandro Brustengi may have taken a vow of poverty, but never a vow of silence. We caught up with the friar after he signed a record deal in London. Are you able to share with us? Okay. Sancta Maria Mater Dei. Beautiful. Bravo. <laughs> Thank you. Until recently, the friar's only audience had been the faithful at his church, including Pope Benedict. The Basilica in Italy is where St. Francis of Assisi founded his Franciscan movement 800 years ago. A friend suggested he audition for record execs. Turns out, friars got talent. The first time the 34-year-old ever boarded a plane was to record at London's famous Abbey Road Studios last year. Although he may have led something of a sheltered life, he drew early inspiration from an unlikely source. When you were younger, did you try to sing like Michael Jackson? Yes. You did? <laughs> I, I danced. <laughs> you danced? <laughs> I was able, when I was young, to do moonwalk. <laughs> mm -hmm. But moonwalking doesn't figure into the friar's act, and he says he's definitely not in it for the fame. You know, you may have a lot of fans now. People may come to see and, and to hear you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's true. I'm a bit shy. <laughs> You're a bit shy? <laughs> yes, she, really. He gets over his shyness the way many performers do. He goes to another place. What do you think about when you sing? It's a moment when I feel a, a direct line with God. It's a moment of heaven. That's what I think. Yes. And as Friar Brustangi has taken a vow of poverty, any profits from sales will go to another place too. Charity. Charlie Daggett of CBS News, London.